Lorenzo! Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta do it every single time. But yeah, now we are back, and so is Xander. Let's see what Mizuki does. You're right by the cart. What do you do? Everybody's facing over. <coughs> Xander. Right. Okay. Um. Uh. I'll um stand there. Oh, so you come on out of hiding, yeah? Yeah. Alright, the knight notices this straight away and he <laughs> just looks shocked. It's like, what? Oh, it's another one. Okay. <laughs> He's just watching you all leave. I leave very, very slowly. Oops. Are you making sure to watch Lipso? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are you keeping an eye on Lipso? <laughs> no. No, of course you're not keeping an eye on Lipso, because it'll be Lipso. Uh, so did Matsuki like change back to her uh, fox form? Uh, yeah, it's in fox form right now. Okay. Yeah, if you tell, you gotta tell me when you transform. I can swap tokens if you wish. Alright. But yeah, anyway, so you all head on, leaving the scene behind. And soon behind. you come upon the city of Abyssa. <laughs> yes, you are now here. I uh, Jade, have a horn. <laughs> uh, Jade, your mic seems to be having a problem, it kind of gives off this little, little pitch in my left ear for some reason. Want me to get you back into the call, like restart it, hopefully fix that? Yes. Does that help? Uh, no. Then move on. <laughs> Anybody else having this problem? No. Hmm. Uh. I hope it's not picking up on recording. Either way, you are now in the city of Abyssa. Welcome! Yay! Yay! Yeah, as long as you don't raise your voice too much, I don't think it will be a problem. Alright then. Simple enough. But yes, you are now in the city. I look around. A city you see a city. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. yeah. We're in a city. Silence. Holy there shit. Are, there are two. No, there are three ways. First, there is this way. And there is that way. In here. And the city noise is a little loud. There we go. But yes, there is this entrance here, which is the main gate. There is a few of the uh, slummy areas. Or there's straight into the palace up here. It's actually an aqueduct, which actually has a path along it. So yeah, I'll lead them along the aqueduct so we can go straight to the castle. It would be bad to go through the city right now. <laughs> Do you want to tell them how you know this is a way to the castle? <laughs> <laughs> Why would I want to do that unless they ask this. me? I want Good point. to know this. You want what? I want to know how you know this is a way into the castle. <laughs> Ah, well, uh, me and the prin- and, uh, oh no, wait, she's not a princess now. You actually hear him say that, he's, that wasn't a mistake by me. Uh, I mean, uh, the current queen and I uh, used to know each other from a while back. Currently, I'm working as the royal alchemist for the kingdom, so yeah, I know that entrance. Don't worry about it too much. Just come along. <laughs> and so... Lai enters the castle, and of course, right away, you're confronted by several guards just waiting for you in from the waterway. Of course, they knew we were going to be here. Oh, and somehow, course. Will, this feels familiar to you, because, <laughs> <laughs> because you feel like this has happened before, uh -oh. and it probably has. <laughs> Shit. Uh-huh. And of course, you hear a gruff voice come from behind the guards going, How did I know you would come through here, of all places? Well, I don't know, maybe because it's the most logical thing to do, he just shrugs his shoulders. <laughs> because you love me so much. <laughs> <laughs> and from behind the so soldiers... Because of course, large... you can't resist the Lalypso! <laughs> Shut up, no. ...come a large armored man. Kaikin. His token's here, but the thing is, there's also, in your journals now, there's also his sheet. 
which you can actually see a full picture of him. Wilfred waves to him. Hi, Kane. How's old age treating you? I am not that old, damn it. Your hair <sighs> is all white, bro. It's it's it's, blonde. it's sandy blonde. Yeah, it's I don't know. It looks pretty blonde. white to me, man. That's something old age does to you, right? Look, I've always been blonde. I was just dirty blonde in my youth. It doesn't. It's like, sir. Oh, right. Um, we'll just come along. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I sure. To... I'm just messing with you. Hey, I know. Uh, I know you're all. You're you're cool. Yeah, I know you're I know like you're what? Seventy years young. I know. It's okay. <laughs> I'm not sorry. <laughs> like he's she looks like he's about to strangle Will, but resist the urge before he just goes. Never mind. Come along. As he turns around, you see. Do you know what kamas are? Japanese kamas, the hand slaves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It looks like there's two of those on his back, but they're large, and they've chained to a device on his back. But yeah, that's Ooh. all the detail you need to know from him. And when he... when uh, Will sees that, he shudders a little, remembering something very unpleasant, and keeps moving. <laughs> uh huh. Do all of you follow? Yes. Yes. I stay quiet the for the most part. The guards, the remaining guards, actually surround you. Though not as many surround uh, Kuha as they do the fox and the gnome. <laughs> why did they surround the gnome so much? <laughs> they I don't trust why. you, you're too short. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why. But yeah, so they guide you into the castle this time. Obviously... Kane's a bit miffed about the fact he had to come all the way here just to grab Will. Because he keeps muttering it under his breath. <laughs> Not hiding it very well. <laughs> I cautiously watch the guards since it's the first time for oh, yes, of course. actually you visit the place. You have not seen the guards yet, so I shall actually produce two pictures of them. These... Of, uh, not like the guards you've seen so far, but they are similar because these guys clearly are better armed than the ones you've seen outside the city. <laughs> they look like royal guards. <coughs> oh wow, you picked up that quick. You can tell that they're expendable because their faces are covered. <laughs> <laughs> good point. Good point. <laughs> Stormtrooper syndrome. <laughs> Look out! They'll shoot at our shields. They shoot directly <laughs> to protected places. But yes, soon you come across the royal hall. The two large doors are pushed open by Kane, and he snaps his fingers so the guards go either side of the hall. As you can snap your fingers in metal gauntlets, it's just a ting sound. <laughs> I hop <laughs> off. And he starts walking I up towards the phone. Mom. For the phone, I, oddly enough. Hmm? I Sorry, hop off my on. mount for walking around on, on my mount. is a little uh, not so nice indoors. Oddly enough, they've let your mount inside. That's what you have to pick up on. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you, it's actually been in here before, so it's quite calm since it's been in this place before. Because you have to oh, talk yeah. to the queen. Well, but, yeah. Yeah. but jumping the off the fox is still a good idea. <laughs> the throne is covered by two sheets of satin as you approach. So, what do you do? Is there anything you want to do, or do you just want to let Kane carry on? I don't have anything carry to do. Carry on, my good sir. Mm -hmm. I was uh, busy preparing a few things. Is there anyone else in the throne room yet? Everybody's in the throne room. Kane's oh. escort you all. So, uh... But you can't see, you can't see the queen yet. Yeah, the only I can't see the queen. Uh, is uh, the archmage there? You know, can't tell. Okay, so I lean over t uh, to Kane and ask him, "Hey, is Frey in?" She told me not to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's, that's cold. cold. That's cold, bro. <laughs> Synced. But yes, as he re as he goes up, he stops at the second curtain, and as it, the curtains part. The queen steps from her throne, and she doesn't look like any normal queen you've seen before. Not in any of your vases, either. For one, this queen, instead of a royal dress or some sort of suit, she's wearing fully decked out battle armor. Her hair is as black as ravens, 
And their eyes are shining and red. Look out! Actually, her, Snow White. her arm is more. <laughs> her arm is actually blackened. But yeah, now her profile is actually in the journal section for you to read. Ooh. How did I come? How did Lipso come across this information? Yeah, you can just find it out anywhere in the city, so if you don't actually know it, like you haven't been here before, such as for non-human races, don't think you would know it. Yeah, that's <laughs> why I'm asking how would Lipso come across this information? True. I actually expected you to spend a little time in the city first, so, but either way. Still, she looks at all of you for a moment and goes, Ah, welcome. It seems like I have picked well if you made it this far. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> I didn't What's expect the... a journey there to be that dangerous. Is there a buffet? <laughs> the queen's actually just looking up. at Lipso with a raised brow for a moment. She's like, I'm Don't mind the gnome. Okay. I'm just smiling. <laughs> I never knew non humans could be so interesting. She actually looks too Mazuki for a moment. That's Since a way to put it, I guess. Mizuki looks like a human. Mizuki, do you look like a human right now? Yeah, it, it, uh, yeah. Uh, it looks like a human. The city. Oh, okay. So you actually do look like a human. Yeah. She's still looking at you. That, She's looking at you for a moment and then looks at you. What a the creeper. Did you just say <laughs> that out loud? No. <laughs> I did not say that out loud. Good, good. So Lipsa does she have some self-control. But yeah, she actually goes to Will now. It's like, so, I take it you found your journey preserable? Um, that's one way of putting it, I guess. He kind of laughs at all and puts uh, his hands behind his back and performs the same trick with the rose and he offers it to the queen with a bow. <laughs> Kane looks like he's about to draw his weapon, but then he just he just, he just sighs and gives up because he knows that he just done it. It looks like he's done it so many times. It's weird on him by this point. It's like, ah. Uh... The queen actually puts out her hand and takes the rose if you hand it to her. Of course. <laughs> she places it actually on the it's a uh, armrest. That's it. The armrest of her phone. You actually see a few dead petals on there as well, Will. So obviously she's kept them there quite a few times. But now, <laughs> roll your... Roll your... How you would like to evade something. Hmm? Reflex save? Not you guys, Will. Uh, evade something because in physically? Roll a reflex. Yeah, basically okay. reflex. Reflex, okay. Dun, 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 uh, wait, dun. I think that was two. Let me double check real quick. Reflex, reflex, uh, what was that? Fuck me, where is it? It's your dexterity. Oh well, it's in attacks menu. Yeah, so it's plus two. Okay, just wanna check. Make sure everything's fine. Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> I've rolled twice so far. I just like, no wait, I've rolled three times and two of those were crits. Amazing. Right then, so almost by reflex, as if you felt this happen before. <laughs> you. you avoid this flying rope that streams past you and wraps around a cabalara just to your left. Uh, Wilfred and actually doesn't... constricts on it, bending it. Wilfred uh, <laughs> doesn't look uh, where the rope came from, he just says, Hi Frey, how are you doing? <laughs> you dirty dog! That's all you hear before somebody bursts out of a satin curtain that's been retracted. It, actually, now... I wish I didn't make that roll because it was gonna be more awesome, what a shame. <laughs> What yes. on earth is going on? This was what's gonna happen if I failed that roll, I can imagine. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna show it on stream as well. Oh god, don't do that. Too late. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. Like a boss, evade it, yo. Her profile is also here as well, it's like... How dare you get so close to a queen once again? You have no manners whatsoever. You're the one throwing ropes! Silence oh, you! Lipso exclaims. Calm down, Frey. I just did it in a well-fashioned manner. It's not like I jumped on her or tried to grab her or something. Yeah. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh... What? By the way, 
you may the picture doesn't show this, but she's actually got several tattoos on her body, and they're actually strange looking. Actually, since you can see them, anybody want to roll arcane knowledge or spellcraft? Me. Go ahead. I've noticed that when you roll twenties, I wrote that everybody gets low rolls right after. <laughs> <laughs> Good to know. But yeah, you don't. You don't know what they are. You I don't need to roll because I know what they are. Mhm. Mm you only know because she told you <laughs> what they are before. <laughs> but yes, she's basically looking at everybody in present, and she's like looks detested towards the gnome. But then she what turns her attention back to me. Why? What do you mean why? I hate the gnome. <laughs> Well, do you still know the world's history? <laughs> do I what? <laughs> do you know the world's history? Because I did put it up for you. The world's history. Lipsa mm -hmm. may be a bit close-minded to that. <laughs> <laughs> In other words, I did not read it, sorry. But yes. <laughs> no, just Lipsa didn't read it very well. Uh, I see. So yes. It's like, ah, honestly, she actually uh, goes by the queen's side, and she's meant to. And the queen goes, now that's over with. <laughs> uh, I take it you have come up with a plan to tackle your great task. Uh, Wilfred looks sideways for a moment and goes, but of course, yes, of course, it would be strange, stupid and weird if we hadn't. <laughs> One second. <laughs> <laughs> I got to check and say her sense motive now. Dare you lie to the queen. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, she knows oh what you're fucking talking about. <laughs> it's like she looks oh. at you and she's just, her crimson eyes are boring into your soul. And she goes, <laughs> you know, uh, yes, my queen? I thought I told no. you never to lie to me again. I'm sorry. Sweat. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <sighs> Either way, can you tell me at least why you have not come up with a plan yet? Well, uh, to be perfectly frank, I'm still kind of uh, getting over the fact uh, what kind of interesting individuals I managed to gather, it's still kind of hard to swallow, if you know what I mean. Okay, so that's your excuse. What about the rest of you? She's actually looking to all of you now. I am speechless. I'm Lipso. <laughs> <You're just> like... <laughs> so Lipso's just like looking back, looking all cheery, is he? Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's what Lipso does. Mazuki, are you staying silent for the time being? Who are you to question our methods? Holy shit. Uh -oh. You called us here. <laughs> I'm just looking at Mizuki. I'm looking at Mizuki with a strange look. Even I'm looking I'm at her kind of worried. Insult royalty. I'm from. Wow, uh, even Nipso knows that. <laughs> they pay. <laughs> the, they pay. The Lost my... Kingdom. I don't respect anybody's authority. But yeah, at this moment, Kane looks to you a little like, wow, she's got, she's feisty, but the Archmage is like, how dare you do such, but then the Queen holds up her hand and goes, well, I ask you simply because I have given you this task. If you cannot perform the task, so to my standards, then what is the point in you taking on this task? Describe your standards! Lipso is very... <laughs> Uh, such short-term memory loss. <laughs> <laughs> the standards of being able to bring peace to the land once again. Does this mean I have to go live with the orcs again? <laughs> Not if you don't want to, dear. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> well, Wait. this is going on, Victor. Uh, <laughs> fuck me, not orcs. Victor. <laughs> uh, Wilfred uh, performs the same trick with the Ross and... Uh, since uh, Frey is too far away, he just shows it to her, trying to bait her. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Okay, he just that. I want to replace it with a smoke pellet. <laughs> slide of hand, slide of All hand. Right. I'm going to make the DC oh, a little higher for you to do it, but go ahead and see if you make it. Ooh, because on, you're a little go. far away from him. 
Uh, plus, you already tried to do that once and I caught you. Yes! Oh my fuck. That's hard enough to make it. Sorry. Yes! <laughs> She's... <laughs> she actually moves forward to see and then. The <laughs> smoke! <laughs> What? Who had just dropped his face? Oh, no, no, face. I'm there. There. That Wilfred is very side. confused. I okay. You turn around and you see Lipso prancing in the back. Ho 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 ho! Yay! <laughs> As the smoke clears, you see this glowing hand <laughs> and fearful eyes. She's like, "Well, what? it wasn't <laughs> me, I, honest. I, I, and honestly. Honestly, this time it wasn't me." I grab the gnome from his collar and lift him up just to keep him in place for a moment. You're no fun. <laughs> so you let him do it, yeah? <laughs> As this is going on, the queen is like, he's surprised by the action. She's like, okay. But yeah, she's still talking to Mazuki. So Mazuki, what do you respond to her basically going, yeah, you have to live up to my standards. This isn't the other way around. Mazuki? Ah, right. Um... <laughs> All right, my turn. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't really have a response to that prepared. So, uh... <laughs> uh, I'll say, Your point is well made, so I'll concede on this. But remember, citizens of Yokai bow to no one. Um... Basically, do you want to do a perception test to try hearing what she mumbles? Yes. Alright, anybody who wants to find out, well... Uh, okay. I might as well. What was it again? So free. Oh, fuck. Gotta do that over again. <laughs> I hear everything. <laughs> I oh. hear everything. I see dead people. It's worse. Kaibo makes it, since he's so close. Um, he makes it. Ah. And what about Kuha? Kuha makes it. Huh. Everyone hears. <laughs> Kuha, Kuha. Everyone hears. She goes, everybody bows down to somebody. But yeah, apart but from that, she didn't not. actually hear it. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> At the moment, Frey is actually looking kind of serious towards Will, and the, some of her tattoos is glowing. She looks like she's about to cast a spell at him. And the queen's uh, not going to Wilfred doesn't wait, he just starts running. He has, he has experienced this before, he knows what to do. And that's run. You son of a bitch! <laughs> she actually <laughs> starts running after him. <laughs> I just hold the gnome up, and <laughs> like, uh, in front of well, me, he's... using, making what? sure that he's a shield for me rather than anything else. While he's I running away, ready. Wilfred actually uh, yells out uh, so you can hear him. Good luck! So, now you're all left in the room with the Queen and the Guard Captain without Will being there. <laughs> and the Guard Captain is looking digested like kids. <sighs> the Queen's actually looking towards you three now. And she's like, well then, what are your plans now? I do she's not honestly know. Do you like... Jokes. I can put a, a mouth gag on him as well if you want. <laughs> she goes, Well, I do enjoy a joke. She, with a stoic face. <laughs> Describe a stoic face. I place the gnome back down stoic. on the it's floor like... and take a few steps back just to be sure. Yeah, it's like a um, just basically blank face. If, it, if you want from the internet, it's poker face. She just look at me, she like looking just medical at you. What is your joke? Oh, I was just wondering. <laughs> oh. Well then. She actually looks disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, she goes, So you're telling me I have hired you and yet you have no plan in what uh, you're meant to be doing. That would be pretty much the case. It's just the fact that I do not ex really know where to start with. I see. I was told that there was more with you with Tengu, wasn't it? I think oh, yeah. we forgot him. Oh. You forgot one of your companions? I'm not sure. I don't think anyone went outside to check. Huh. Which is Tengu. true. I see. Which is true. No one went outside to check. <laughs> <laughs> we could see from the window, y'all. Come on. 
It seems like my judgment before was correct. If you meet Will again, tell him he is the head of this expedition. And tell oh. him to please deliver a plan to me. Once he has done it. All right, then. <laughs> Will, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's basically just saying, yeah, he's the leader. <laughs> it's clearly he's the leader, since you guys are not talking to her or giving any plans or whatsoever. Okay, so okay. Like, okay, I know. whatever. I, I know a joke. Turn <laughs> around. <laughs> That's not the joke. She looks <laughs> Shut up. Turn around. She looks it'll, be I, I, it'll be funny. It'll be funny. I swear. <laughs> funny for who? And then she I... actually, <laughs> she actually obliges you and turns around. Okay, I use disguise self to look like Will. Oh shit. Okay. <laughs> he gives me a plus ten to my disguise, and I adjust my height to Will's height. So when she turns around, she actually just sees you, like she Will. Sees yeah, she sees Will. All right then. Am I meant to make a perception? Hang on. Am I meant to make a perception roll to see for it, or you disguise hey, one? You could. If I'll roll a disguise check, if you want. Yeah, let's see how accurate your disguise is. Because if your disguise is accurate enough, she won't have to roll. Oh. Your disguise is pretty fucking good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, Holy it, shit, 90! Well, it, okay, is Frey still there? No, no she left. She's oh, okay. chasing okay. after Will. I turn around to Mizuki, and I go like, Watch this! Oh, Mizuki! My dying love! <laughs> <laughs> Please, marry me! Because I am so lonely! I'm not going to save Lipso from this Have one. a rose! And I use the rose I took from Will. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> she actually, she's actually looking on for a moment. She's like, uh, "Hang on, this actually gonna implore a." Let's see. I doubt she could, but let's see if she can. What's Mizuki's reaction? <laughs> That's what I want to know. <laughs> yeah, Mizuki, while I'm rolling, what's your reaction to Lipso slash Will doing this? I'm going to play along with it purely to spite the queen. Spite? No, don't oh, you mean to spite bitch. Will? Why would it spite the queen? <laughs> er, hmm, maybe spite wasn't the right word. Uh, to mess with her head, I guess. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, looked at the I could never work up the courage it. until now. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't notice. <laughs> She's like, just looking on like, well, this is to be expected, though you have never done it in front of me before. What, she thinks I'm Will now? She definitely thinks you're Will. But what she saw me run away, how, how, how is she fooled? <laughs> because she literally thinks she returned. How? <laughs> that makes so no annoying. sense. <laughs> and it's like, if you won't accept my love, I'll have to give it to another. He turns no, around, then to, she go, no, she, he yeah, turns actually, around to the queen. <laughs> actually, hang on. The queen goes, well, since you've done this, I suppose I have no other choice. She reaches down to her side and draws the re rapier at her side and starts walking <sighs> towards you. Good job. <laughs> Good job. And I said, I'm, oh, not, oh, I'm not intervening with this one. Oh, mighty Watch Priscilla! From the side. Please, smite me with your love. <laughs> By the way, uh, oh can he disguise his voice? Yeah. Oh. Yes, yeah, disguise self as well. <laughs> oh, yeah, with a, with a 38 roll. It's a spell. Ah, okay. But yeah, at this point, I think Will's being chased back into the room. Uh, to see this curious situation. What the fuck are you guys doing? And I see uh, the gnome has actually turned into me and I'm like, Oh, yeah, that shit's not gonna work. She's got magic eyes. Oh, of course she does. <laughs> what, what human in the world? I'm sorry. What human in the world has crimson eyes? <laughs> um, she has red, if we're going off eyes. Path, if we're going off Pathfinder, uh, Osirian. Ancient Osirians have have red, crimson eyes. Yeah, an ancient race, exactly. So how but is still a human, right? still human? Yeah, you don't know that. From all you, what you know from humans, that they all got natural eye colors. 
Yep. <laughs> I even pointed it out. But yeah, basically she's just smiling down to you. She didn't cut off all your clothes, of course. She just cut a little bit. Probably knocked off your hat or something, since she did scored so low. She's like, well, that was a fun joke. She says as she puts her sword away and starts walking back to her phone. I still haven't entered like, the oh. glamour, and I'm just looking at the hat, just going like, oh, you cut my feather. <laughs> <laughs> you deserve but, yeah. it. Will? Oh, wait a minute. I forgot I'm which pretty thing. sure everyone else thought I was Will. <laughs> oh, yeah, everybody did. You were that good. I think she Will... Was... I think Will needs to make a Will save to think it's me. <laughs> <Doo -doo. laughs> oh, oh, my God, why am I standing over that? there? Exactly. Damn, I'm handsome. Yeah, okay, you get to roll Will save. Damn, I'm handsome! <laughs> <laughs> There's my disguise check. Go ahead. <laughs> what the hell is that 19? Do you want to try rolling your perception? Uh, it's my disguise. 9 plus my 10 for using the spell. Uh, don't they get Christ. the bonus since they should probably see that something fishy is impersonating you probably me? probably see that... Why am I there? The DC for it is quite low. That's your bonus. So, well... Oh, <laughs> you are fucking handsome in that mirror, Will. You oh, well. I, so I stand up and I go like, My long lost brother! <laughs> Oh. It is I, Victor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on. Confusion and together. Oh my God, I got a brilliant idea. I walk, I run over to him, and I turn to Frey. Ha! Now, now I'm gonna put the oldest trick in the book, the the old switcheroo, and I start moving back and forth with uh, the fake me, so she's confused who the real Will is. But Frey's not there. Yeah, uh, she's right after me. She Ah. Yeah, she came right after me. So, oh my she, gosh! And I, and I just, just uh, whisper to I just whisper to Lipso, dude, play along. She's gonna kill me. You don't know it's Lipso. <laughs> she doesn't know who's who. <laughs> Hang on. As she comes in, guess what? She can't tell that you two are which one's which because Lipso disguise is so good. But it looks like she doesn't care. And she did. She go. She she goes. Black tentacles. <laughs> Level four huh. spell. Bit. I run away. And, and yeah. <laughs> no, Suddenly, you get tripped, and we run us away. No. <laughs> I tell you for check in a minute. <laughs> the tattoos on her arm disappear, and she casts the spell. So, yeah. Time for a grappling round. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. No. 28. Rolling CMB, and that means you guys have to roll as well against it. So, do we, what do we roll? We don't roll anything. She's Only she rolls. Oh, okay. Yes, I gotta roll against your the, thing. No. Uh, if it's a level 4 spell, so what's the DC on it? I'm reading it now. Our CMD has to beat that. Oh crap! She probably won't. Oh no! Yep, it, well, no it actually rolls CMB against you. Ah, shit. Because that they're, they're, they're living one, tentacles. One, Hang on a minute. Roll one, roll one, roll one. Come on. Roll low, yo. Roll low. It won't. Nine. Eight. Okay. Right. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> <laughs> does it? Does that capture two of you? Fucking yeah. I think even if we put both our things together, it still won't be enough. I have a 10. Right. I have an 11. <laughs> uh, yeah, both of us together are not enough to beat Wait. that one roll. How close are you to them, Kua and Mizuki? Oh, shit. <laughs> I'd say pretty close. You wouldn't be 20 feet away, would you? No, they're close. <laughs> Does that beat your CMD as well? Gee, I wonder. Gee, I wonder. Um, no. There's no way that, that doesn't beat it. Yeah, it does, because you got 13 CMD. And... Where's Kuha? Let's see. Defenses. You're samurai, so... Yeah, it beats it. So, you <laughs> suddenly, you're all just captured up in these tentacles that burst from the ground. In their shadowy forms and wrap all around you. <laughs> I want to make an escape How? for this, Jack. That's fine. You mm -hmm. can do that. 
I yeah. squirm, squirm around as the tentacles grab around me. What the <laughs> hell is going on? <laughs> it needs to make another. Oh wow! Check. Okay, they're quite strong. No wonder everybody gets this power. But yeah, <laughs> you actually don't break free of their power. However, the <laughs> however, I think you see that the queen's had enough, and she goes, "Frey." If you would, she goes, Frey goes, fine, and she releases the spell without hurting you guys. <laughs> but she starts moving up towards the throne. What's your look, uh, what's your outlook on the new android race? What? The new android race oh, that was released the in the last book. Oh, yeah. I made a, yeah, they're, they're, they're kind of cool. Oh. Yeah, I was looking at it going they're like, futuristic. their character level is their class levels. Like, their character level mm. is the total of all their class levels. You that can, sounds pretty fucking you know, overpowered. Not really. The thing is, they still have to gain experience. Your, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they I have don't, know, so, I don't so know what they think about the Android race, but I'm definitely a fan of the iPhone race. <laughs> <laughs> You're funny. Get back to the game. <laughs> so mean. Right. So yeah, after that debacle, the queen's basically looking at all of you and going, "Right, you all must do this mission. You may go for and come and go from the palace as you please, and you may stay here as long as you like. But please, while you are here, come up what you must need to do. Okay? Yes, my queen. I shall not fail you." She looks out rest of I'm still okay. using Will's voice. It's like you're gonna fail so much. <laughs> so it's like his conscience. <laughs> I am your conscience. Oh god. <laughs> I thought I didn't have one. <laughs> this is new. <laughs> this is new to me. What do I do? Right, yeah, she goes. You may leave now, unless you have other things to say to me. Um as much as I adore your presence, my highness, there's actually something I would like to speak with Frey in private if possible, and he looks over to her. If she's not trying to Frey. kill me still. Deadpan voice. Uh, Deadpan will voice. It's a lie. <laughs> Shut up. But yeah, but At this point, I probably <laughs> elbow him to the gut. Okay, then make a will save. Will save? Uh, how much will do I have? Probably none. <laughs> Let me double check. Just make a will save. Um, yeah, Reasonable. I don't have anything. Just make it. You're interacting with the glamour. There you go. You pass. You now realize that it's Lipso. <laughs> I think it was kind of easy to guess at this point. You didn't <laughs> know that, though. But now that you're is true. Positive. Yeah, okay. but the most don't determine the only one who's, <laughs> like, not there is Lipso, and that is a copy of Will. I think he guessed yeah. it was Lipso, yeah. but now he knows that the little guy is... Li he could have guessed opinion. that Lipso died. <laughs> 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 Lipso <laughs> died and got him. replaced by a clone. <laughs> but uh, considering anyway. how he's been acting, that's not too far from <laughs> being possible. Yeah, and nobody cared. <laughs> and that is true as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can just imagine we were turns to the room two minutes later and sees Lipso mangled on the ground, covered in blood and death, and he's like, what happened? Ah, yeah, he died. Uh, we moved on. Get get on <laughs> get on the same page. Or we're, we're past that. <laughs> so, he's like an afterthought. Yeah. <laughs> Frey actually is, looks very calm now, and she nods. Alright, well, uh, I'll meet you guys in a few minutes, alright? Try not to cause any more trouble. Also, Lipso. For the for the love of God, please stop looking like me. You're embarrassing me. That's your opinion. <laughs> so yeah, Wilfred uh, goes off to the side with Frey. All right then, we can do that talking private if you wish. What do the rest of you do? Ah, huh, well, since I don't think I have anything. I go to town. Here. Well, yeah, go going to down to town would be a good idea, but I'm not going with Leaf, so. No, you're going with Will. <laughs> <laughs> This might right. be interesting. Going oh, to two. Awesome. Uh, on the way, on the way, on the way, probably a few of the mates slap you. <laughs> if you still what? look at Will, yes, you take three non-lethal damage instantly from the amount of mates. 
<laughs> I'm only kidding. If you want to try to avoid the slaps, then you can. Avoid. I'll just stop being Will. <laughs> after a few, <laughs> after a few will, ten, that's right. All of a sudden, you notice their angry looks and you go like, I'm going to be someone else. I'm going to be me. <laughs> just <laughs> all of a sudden, I shimmer a little bit and then I'm a gnome. They look surprised and they're like, oh, uh, I'm going about the business. Just, just I'm like, hi. <laughs> yeah, you can see that not many people are a fan of Will, despite this being his home nation. <laughs> so, it hurts of being a ladies' man. It's just like Jack Sparrow. Hey, so, yes. in the end, he got laid, so. <laughs> but yeah, you're in a bitter. You're in their town. You're about round about here-ish in the main town. It's the main town area. So, what are you looking for? Money. Mm. Like the, well. town, the town is live and bustling. The buildings still retain their wall-like nature, though colours decorate each wall of the shops to make it stand out from the rest. Well, since we're kind of just waiting for Will at this point, I guess I'm heading down to the pub. Yeah, down to the pub. That's a good yeah. call. It, That's always a good place. The pub is actually quite easy to spot. they got two banners outside that look like giant mugs. Yep. As you can see, it's without these banners, it would be pretty difficult to tell what shop is which, since everything's so uniform. <laughs> but I suppose I'd yep, so, take Kazuki? it. Hmm? Mm. Mm. Uh, I'm asking if they follow you. Sure. Oh, yeah. All right, then. Into the pub. Kishki stays outside. Because he's too big to get in. Uh, she's too big to get inside. Of course she waits outside. She gets some looks, though. That's about it. This yeah. horse is about it, so you know. <laughs> she goes to chat with the horses. <laughs> she doesn't speak oh, horse. She actually races against horses. <laughs> well, at least she could hang with them. Nah. Yeah. Don't horses. But yeah. So you're in the pub now. Mm. And this pub, as you can find out as soon as you enter, is called the Silken Vixen. Oh. Ah. Oh, wow, wow. <laughs> <laughs> and there's actually there's a very large, heavy set woman at the bar serving drinks, chatting with customers. The atmosphere is very relaxed in here. Huh. That's about to change. Oh shit. <laughs> I slowly stride over to the bar counter and I order myself a beer. I love, of course. Hang on a minute. Here you go. Like she, she looks like she. Hmm? Hmm? You're about to say something. I wasn't. I was only about to say thank you. Oh, okay. Yeah, she doesn't bring out a tankard, but it's more like a tiny barrel, and she just pops the top off. It's just ready beer, and it's chilled as well. well that's kind of convenient, to be honest. <laughs> so, like, that'll be two silvers, mate. I, I reach down into my kimono and pull out small purse with my money, or bag, money bag, and I hand over the two silver coins to her. Thanks, love. And she goes over to put it away. I slip the bag back into my kimono and I take my beard to whatever keg, whatever thing. And, and holy men drink? <laughs> well, first and foremost, I'm a samurai. <laughs> Good point. You're, you're a guardian, you're not a priest, so you can still drink. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And I look uh, look around for a table to sit down. Alright then. So, you go and sit down. There's a clean table waiting, waiting for you. And, Lipso, what do you do? I summon a banjo. Oh, just, okay. Just don't sing about anything too... ...provocating. He's going to think about something provocating, I know. <laughs> I may have a high fortitude I'm gonna find, I, I'm gonna find the song. Oh, you actually got a song by you. Oh, shit. <laughs> yes. Just a moment, I got to go to the toilet. There it is. It's alright. Okay. Here's the song. 
I linked it. Oh god. I wonder whose microphone is picking up that song. The banjo and the instrument for me! <laughs> <laughs> Will you perform? Yep, that's what I do. I stand on an empty table, put my hat down, and start and start this song. Will you perform it to see how well you do? That sounds okay. a lot like uh, Hearthstone's music, by the way. Yep. It's not. <laughs> Wait, that is Hearthstone's music. Do what I need the to fuck? roll two? Huh? Do I need to roll two? Uh, no, you only need to roll your performance. Well, That's it. I know, I'm roll. There's. Whatever. It's the same for right. both. What? Yeah, what do you mean? Do you have two performances? Well, I'm singing and playing an instrument. No, I'd say one performance is good They're enough. They're both the same. Yeah, you do reasonably well. You actually get a. Uh, Two gold out of a deal by people throwing silvers into your, and coppers into your hat. Yay! And I return. You also return. came yeah, to my so mind much. about <laughs> about drinking, uh, being allowed to drink. I am in the pub with lip, so I cannot do it without a beer. Let's just say that. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I can't. I just I just can't. No, I just can't. And for my next performance. Oh god, no, never mind. Applejack! <laughs> so, you're in a bar, and about, I would say, half an hour goes by, maybe a little bit more, until Will finally turns up. Directed oh. by the guards, of course. <laughs> yeah, that happens sometimes. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, what's the barman's name again? Because I know her already. I'll check my notes. Would you know the barmaid's name? Yep. Marin. Hey, Marin, how's it going? He waves to her and smiles. Hey, boy, how you doing? Uh, been better, but, uh, you know. Good, good. Will sees me up on the table, dancing and singing. Uh, he leans over to Mitsuki and uh, cool hands and he asks, what's he doing? I have absolutely no idea. And I take a sip I'm of singing. my beer. <laughs> My beer is very enjoyable. Huh. Um. All right then. Uh, Will goes to get uh, a drink uh, as well and uh, yells uh, over his shoulder. Hey, Mitsuki, you want something? Uh, sure. Whatever you get. Hmm. How's about maybe some red wine? Ah, <sighs> this again. Fine, fine. I'll get you a beer. Will goes and orders two beers. And you can. She goes. I'm only be too silver for you, love. Thanks, dear. He winks at her and uh, leaves the money on the table along with the rose. <laughs> it's amazing you get all these roses. But yeah, she takes them. He goes back to the table and sits down, gives uh, Mitsuki her beer and raises his glass for a toast. <laughs> to our new adventure and, uh, you know, hopefully we don't get killed and all. Because of Lipso, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> what about Lipso? I'm bringing in, I'm bringing in customers with my awesome singing, and I chuck That's my beer faster. Be allowed. As a result, <laughs> that's actually the only reason you're allowed to stand on that table. <laughs> Why is that? Because some people in the room are actually looking at you like, what the? I guess my get up is kind of weird. <laughs> oh yeah, your get up. It's not like they're racist against other races or anything. <laughs> Definitely not that. <laughs> but yeah. You all know in the pub. And guess what I'm going to ask you to do? No! Um, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> so you don't know. I don't know. As you've not known for the last two sessions, make a plan of what you plan to do. Oh yeah, that. Well, this Am is a right good opportunity, you? so let's uh, open up the map, since we're on the table, sitting and having a drink. And so, you open up the map. Flying okay, then. Yeah, uh, 
Once we go there and see what's the situation, maybe we will correct that on the map. I don't know why that useless date put that there. Don't mind him. <laughs> well now, uh, it would have been uh, better if the Tango was here, but uh, from hearing what kind of troubles uh, are coming from the northeast, I guess it should be best to check on the Orc and Gnome Kingdom first, since it's kind of close nearby. What do you guys think? It really sounds like a good plan. Yeah, it would be a shame if the doing. Orcs if the orcs start to get riled up. Yeah, that would be kind of a big problem. We might as well see what the situation is over there. Uh -huh. Do you want to make any markings on the map for your plan? Uh, yes, actually. Uh, I'm thinking Lumagov is their capital. Maybe we should make a stop through there, check on uh, what's the current uh, situation in the Orc and Gnome Kingdom, and eventually maybe move over to Everhorn since it seems to be the biggest uh, orc city on the border with the desert sea. So if a war is brewing, that's where it's gonna show first. Oh boy, this oh, is gonna be fun. So, what do you, you guys think? This is gonna be fun. I don't think <laughs> I'm allowed in Lumagoth anymore. Uh, do you it's tell so why? Cheerfully. It's like... I may have pissed off the war chief once or seven well, times. Well, at least you you are good. Uh, at least your disguises are good. So, hmm, <laughs> they better hold for a couple of weeks straight. I guess I'll have to disguise myself as Will. Uh, no, you're never doing no. that again. Are you sure? Yes. yes. <laughs> no, In fine. unison. So yeah, you go to Abyssal, to Lumagov, to Everhold? Yeah, we'll pass through Lumagov, see what's the situation in the Orc Kingdom and the Gnome Kingdom, and uh, presumably we'll continue on our way to Everhorn. I think you're kind of rushing it, we still haven't made it to Lumagov, so... <laughs> These are just your plans, you're marking this out. Ah, okay, so this is our plan. Lumagov. Okay, okay, okay. This is our plan so far. If everyone mm -hmm. else agrees, of course. If you have any other ideas and suggestions, I'm all ears. Is there any news from Drumor? Like, you are things know. all... Uh, I'm just thinking... Would the gnome know? Would you know? <laughs> I think have I would. Have you been there before? Because you're from there, if you remember. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, it's a port. It's a poor place. They haven't had any news on what's going on. Yeah, okay. So but I figure plan, that I figure that if something happened in Trumor, it would anyways re the news would anyways reach to Lumagoth, so we'd hear about the over there. Yeah, Lumagoth is the capital, so everything that's going on we should be able to hear from in there, so yeah. Plus the capital's yeah. the closest uh, place, so I think it's a good Point to start. I agree. Agreed. Good. I don't know where you could stop by the Moy Shrine. <laughs> 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 but yeah. So that's your Actually, basic yeah, plan, since uh, I uh, haven't gotten back to Key, so yeah, maybe we should stop by there, personal reasons. <laughs> Say we don't. <laughs> so Will marks down this. <laughs> <laughs> Just a detour. You know, if you guys uh, wanna pray, it's a good place to pray. <laughs> <laughs> what was movie. that? It's the Goofy movie all over again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is your way, Maxi? plan Left so far. Right. <laughs> right. So you plan to go into cook? Orc territory first. Yes. You want to yes. find out what the threat is. Yes. Yeah. All right then. The orcs getting angry. And I figure that if I manage to level up, so I could actually get myself to become a paladin, and then visiting the shrine would be something more interesting. Fair enough. Fair enough. So, awesome. if that's all your plan takes, I think we can end the session here. Oh, okay. Already? That was quick. Okay. Well, 
I expected you to be a bit more complex of a plan than that, but that's fine. <laughs> it's good. It's a good plan. What are you doing? I'm putting an arrow around. So yes. <laughs> yes. Today was a good day. Today Apart was a good day. The bad days. <laughs> you met the evilest wizard by far, Balazar. <laughs> and then you, and then we met the tentacle witch. I blame the damn gnome for everything. Yes. And everybody agrees that every everything that happened was his fault. Okay, good. Yes. <laughs> well, that's it for today. I hope everybody had fun. Yep. Mm hmm Good, good. So I'll see you all next week, and have a good day. Goodbye. All right. So you take Frey to the side, and while everybody else leaves, what do you say to her? Uh, sorry about earlier. Like you saw, we've got kind of a <laughs> interesting bunch over there. <laughs> Yeah, I did notice. I hope you're um, not mad about what happened. I'm not sure what happened to that flower. It's fine. Really, it's fine. It's just... I expected... Uh, I mean, never mind. What did you want to talk about? Uh, yeah, I wanted to ask you since I haven't had a moment to talk with the, clean, with the queen uh, alone lately. Is she doing alright? Oh, she's her normal self. She has a lot of uh, on her mind, especially with this new threat that's coming. Yeah, let's hope it's something we can handle before it gets out of hand. And preferably, hopefully it's not nothing important at all and it's just a lot of rumors. <laughs> that, would be, that would be very enjoyable. Uh... No, honestly, if it was, do you think she would actually call? you into doing something? No, which worries me. Yeah. Mm. Wilfred uh, claps his hand together to suddenly change uh, the mood of the conversation and smiles. Happy anniversary! Huh? Anniversary? <laughs> he chuckles gleefully and uh, takes something from uh, his backpack, a small uh, wrapped up gift, and hands it over to her. She looks at it in surprise as she takes the package and looks down to it, opening it slowly right in front of you. Uh, what she finds inside is a small handmade uh, portrait of her over the open window and a small red rose on the bed uh, side table in a vase. Yeah, she sorry about the quality. This thing is like, I was like pretty young when I drew this, so. You know, uh, 10 years ago I wasn't so good, I'm way better now if you give me a second chance, you know. She's kind of blushing furiously, she's like, Sh shut up! And she tries pushing you back. But it's not a proper push, it's more like, get out of here. Mm. <laughs> and she keeps holding it. Talk to you later then, okay? I'm, go I'm gonna go take care of my new friends. Oh! And uh, again, happy anniversary! <laughs> he chuckles as he leaves. Yeah, she's like, damn idiot. But she does nothing else and she walks away with a torture in hand. <laughs>